Good morning, it's Dr. Klumber and I'm back with my Let's Play RimWorld. Um, what's that say? Not a lot really. If I look a bit rough to you, that's probably because I've been up for about 10 minutes. I don't have a lot of time to do this recording today, but I promised myself I would record every week. Um, and it's Saturday, so recording we are. Rimworld, 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 where are we going? So far, I've just watched the first two episodes uh, back. It's been a pretty tame ride, really. Uh, not a lot going on, so I suspect that this week we should get a bit more action. Uh, I've put someone to harvest these strawberries and things outside. We're getting some walls built, that's useful. Um, yeah. Now, one of the things that makes this particular playthrough uh, worthwhile is that we've got a really good builder, uh, White. White's building capabilities now at 16 and learning so quick that they're soon going to be 17, 18, 19, 20. That is brilliant for us because that means that in the longer term we don't need to worry about the quality of stuff and everything should be built rather quickly as well. So we can build quite quickly, which is why we decided rather than to go for a dig into the stone build, we've gone for a build build. Uh, if that didn't make sense to you, it didn't really make sense to me either, but we shall leave that be. So as we've passed the week, just checking what we have available, we've got meals, pretty decent amount. We're getting some leather and stuff in, that's a decent amount as well. We've got some blocks left still despite building a new stone wall and uh, we've still got steel we've still got components we've still got berries and herbal medicine our freezer is sort of working it is warm outside but hmm. uh oh a raid a group of pilots from the pilots pirates from the crazy outfit have arrived nearby they are attacking immediately a group of one. Oh no. Um, uh, he's coming from there. Do I worry about this? Not really. I believe we've got a guy who can actually kill things quite effectively. Tony. Also my doctor, which is a bit annoying. But um, Tony is going to take a position here. And I'll take it from there. Ooh, pigs. Oh yeah, they're my pigs. I have pigs. Oh, and an eclipse, just to make things even more interesting. Yeah, they wandered up in the last episode, didn't they? So I could eat those if I needed to. Pigs are good, for bacon reasons. You know what, Tony? I actually do want you to get forward a bit. Get the full advantage of him having to cross over this sort of crappy soil it's slower for him he's not going to he's where what where's he going good Don't kill Nash. No. Good job, Nash. Well done. Sorry you had to take some stabbings. Whilst you were food poisoned as well, poor thing. But we knocked him out. So that is excellent news. We can now see if he's useful or not. Um, is he useful? He can shoot, which is why he was attacking with a knife. And he can cook a little, mine a little, craft a little. He's very neurotic. And he's not very bright. But other than that, he might well be a useful 
soul. So let's see if we can arrest him. We've got a prison. There we go. Oh. Everybody's going to bed because that's what you do. Poor Nash has got to do everything on his own. Alright, who's my doctor? Uh, Tony and Chirpy, I've got two, which is excellent. You go and prioritize tending him. Recruitment difficulty, that's pretty good, so we're going to try that. You go and prioritize tending to him. And hopefully everything will work out all right. <clears throat> Good. Everybody's asleep. Everybody's going to be happy. Health, food poisoning. Only 17 as well. It might be useful, this cow fellow. There we go, there's another room finished. Mm -hmm. Good. Now I need to decide what to do with that room. Well, one of the things we can do is make it a joy room, which is always handy. Let's, how much wood have we got left? Not enough. Let's cut some wood. And then, when we've done that, we can then... Uh, we've got enough wood orders there anyway. Let's cut everything inside, because that's annoying me. And then we'll take it from there. I don't know why I paused the game there. Again, that's one of my habits, I think. things I need to think about is what sort of defense do I want because I could put a turret up at some point and are we actually doing any research microelectronics so that is important whoever is doing my research needs to be hurry up with it really for us to do that. Who's my priority plant cutter? Nash. Well, he's been in bed so that's not something we can help with. Mm -hmm. We're going well, we're clearing up this space now. No, I don't want any travel opportunities. I've got four bloody colonists. Where do you want me to go with them? <clears throat> there, tidying up nicely. It doesn't make a huge difference, but what it does is it stops it looking like a tip. And then when we get more uh, trees and things, we can start making it look pretty. Um... Oh, of course. Sorry, Nash. That was very naughty of me. Um, I need wood, boys. I need wood. 
Right. I actually think what we should do here is make it into a um, hydroponics unit. Thinking about it. Rather than make it into a useless entertainment type thing. Oh, these are dangerous. Massive fires if we get hit, we're screwed. Oh, and beavers, that's always handy. Where are they? Uh, quite far away. We'll toggle them anyway. They might well die in the flash storm, of course. Um, yeah, hydroponics is what we want, so if I'm not mistaken, we researched it. So we're building a vent here. This room is going to get quite warm because that's where we cook, etc, etc. Uh, I can add a couple more generators here as well so that it really gets warm. And then we can filter it out into the hydroponics basin. Now what I need is to work out what the best way to stack them is. Because in between all of them we need to have a lamp. Uh, I always forget where that is. Sun lamp. Excellent room size. Look at that. Look at that. So that sits there. And then we have. Hmm, do we want two? I think we do. I think we do. Uh, Probably not the most efficient way actually thinking about it, but I'm sure we could fit in more uh, just by stacking them on top of each other and all that. But at the moment this seems to make sense. Now what we definitely do need if we do that is more power generation. So oh we need to look into that. My nose seems to be tickling. Probably getting a cold. You might even be able to hear that. My apologies for all the odd noises. I want this to run through everything as well. We're getting a lot of food poisoning. Someone's cooking that can't actually cook. I don't know if I need to do something about that, yeah. So what we're trying to achieve now is to prepare for winter. The sooner we prepare for winter the better of course, as you can understand. Um, and with the hydroponics we should just about be able to keep our food sustenance going. We can then bring the piggies in here and butcher them when they get knackered. So That's all pretty positive. A lot of work for White again, as you can tell, she's constantly busy. I have got a good cook, why are we getting bad meals to? Hmm, six and seven. They shouldn't be producing crap meals, really. We need warm clothes. Now the problem I have is I don't really have a lot of leather etc etc because we've just not been building it yet um, make a packer from beaver skin So this needs steel and components, we've not got anywhere near enough steel, we've still got that bloody storm going on, that looks like this. Why is this fire? Got a lot of deer as well, it might be handy to uh, pick up on at some point. But 
Let's, for now, let's forbid half of these. Um, doing it wrong, aren't I? Let's forbid this side of it. Because that lamp will cover that. A bit of concentrated building needs to be happening here because we're asking to do a lot. We'll need more steel soon. Where do we get more steel? Thought we'd already struck steel inside. No, that's not it. Finish that off. Now. We've done that. We can get rid of that, that should have happened already and then my room is finished, so that's good news that's uh, a good first thing to have done now we need steel steel we found some steel here, so let's uh, orders mine Ranenburg, hello, do we want to save you? Yes, you're a very good miner and an excellent grower. You're an oaf, but you are lazy. And you don't like men. Interesting that we're getting so many early on, to be honest. Nash, why don't you try and save this fella? Non prisoner bed in a safe temperature. Shit. I should have built some more bedrooms already actually. Um where can we build beds? We can build beds here. Temporarily build me a bed here. We're running very low on wood now, which is annoying the life out of me. That should not happen. So everybody's got to go and get some wood. Why is he sleeping on the floor? just buggering off isn't it yeah there he goes I don't understand that algorithm when we actually recruit them and when we don't and a bit confusing but hey ho There's a lot going on so we need to make sure we deprioritize this again uh, like that we need to get the crops in because these are clearly done. That's why chirp is here. Rice is done. <coughs> I think we've got a level 5 grower, so that's good. Don't know why it says it needs power. Hmm. Did I not have two dogs? Did I just have one? 
have been trained yet. Let's do some hauling on her. She's been reasonably food secure at the moment. Why have you not been recruited yet? You like Stash? Um, Come on, dude. Say yes. Oh, 8% chance as well. Getting close. Dining room, awful. I think. I think we need to clean it up a bit. <coughs> oh, little bunny rabbit killed by the fox. Fishes, beasts, foxes. Uh oh, I know where that's gonna go. concerned about this freezer, it doesn't really seem to want to freeze, I'm going to have to build a wall there as well, stone wall, after this room is finished. Summer crops. <clears throat> it's a uh, it's a slow game. I don't know what's going on with random uh, Randy, but I'm not feeling the difficulty level yet. Did I set it too low? I might have done. Oh uh, well, it does not matter. The longer the let's play lasts, the more you can enjoy it. Maybe. I'd like my research to be done now. I can do with some turrets. Some long range mineral scanner. Uh, it would look like gold or jade, but not in which these guys uh, build. Oh, I don't know what happened there. Um, Hmm. How come that doesn't have power? Because I'm sure that oh, why is that not connected? Wow, Tony. That was active killing. And why are they outside? find some more steel. I think I might dig exploratory um, from here.
I need to build a door on it for a good mesh here. Like that. And then that keeps everybody reasonably happy. Oh, look at that. How lucky. How lucky. Straight away. Can't be better than that. do with this fella becoming a member because then he can actually just start doing stuff for me rather than me a pain in the ass. <sighs> mm, always takes time. So these are strawberries. We could keep them as potatoes actually, yeah. Three strawberry, three potatoes. Ah! No! Who's gonna kill? Psychically dull, nervous, abrasive. They're both nervous. Mm. Take it too long for him to actually uh, be recruited, so we need to change his status now. He's clearly a pain in the ass. Uh, you don't get medicine anymore, you don't get food, just throw him out. His nose has been shot off, which will hurt, but yeah. I have my graves, I think they're ready. Good. Yeah, another man. Okay, are you useful? Two for uh, construction. Oh no 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 no! Not a pyromaniac. Oh, I hate pyromaniacs. It's only two. Jade Club. Nice. Oh no, not the stupid dog. Let's go slow. Why are you not firing? Oh, you don't have you don't even have a bloody gun. I got that wrong. Ah, shit. I'm gonna kill my dog now, aren't they? Spine crack. Oh dear. Oh dear. Where's that useless soul? Here. Yeah. Draft. Rescue. Wow, my dog killed him! <laughs> really? We did too. Whoa, 
Well done, doggy. Got all of them. All of them. That's very good. Badly, but we'll try it anyway. So, we've had our fun, we've had an attack, we've got lots of injured people everywhere, and um, I'm an idiot for sending someone in to a fight without a weapon. I don't know why I thought Chirpy had a weapon. The White has a weapon. Right. Look, if you can be downed by a dog. Yeah, no, we're not keeping you. You're too depressive, so you can go. And then someone can carry the other fella. Oh, he's dead. Yay. That was to be expected. I hope you're looking after this dog. Mm. Right, that was this episode. I hope you enjoyed that. We had a bit of fun and excitement. We've got someone down um, with a cracked spine and leg and femur and neck. That does sound painful, you have to be honest. Right, that's Dr. Clumber, and I hope to see you next time. Bye-bye, Dr. Clumber, out.